Round two. Let's play this one. Yikes. A little slow, but with the life gain, we can maybe come back. As long as they're not too aggro-y. One removal spell really puts us in the hurt locker. But well, I guess we'll try it. We got land. And hell, maybe we get our paladin. That'll be sweet. Well, if our opponent shows up. Alrighty, showed up. Let's get a forest. Or plains, rather. Oh boy. A long Memorial Day. Green deck. Well, we won't show them our forest yet. Keep it a mystery. I don't think we have any double green till turn six. Another blue deck. Bounce is annoying. Let's get a flyer out there. I like our hand. It's looking pretty good to me. Fatter Geist. Let's still play the Seraph. Block that guy all day. Maybe draw some bounce out of his hand. See all colors of the rainbow? Bower Passage. That'd be real bad for us. Uh, here, let's play Bracers. Equip. Just for life gain. Maybe draw a trick out of them. And now we play our Death Toucher. Bonding with the creature we care less about. Well, Surf the Dawn would be pretty good. They should have played and just showed them everything. Now we'll play the Geist. Maybe that's bad. I just don't like to put all my eggs in one basket. I guess this allows us to get in for damage on both. We can swing for five. Effectively getting two in. So we would, I don't know. That could be bad. Let's play this guy. Uh, if he double blocks, that's six damage. He'll still live with joint assault. Are we going to terrifying presence? Yeah, let's get in there with everything. Well, if we terrifying presence, we don't kill anything, so yeah. Not the best use of joint assault, but we get to kill the fetter geist and our guy lives. Plan out our tricks early, but we have a commanding board presence with a terrifying presence in hand. Alrighty. The all eggs in one basket. I like it. I like my death touch play now. So we still have a nice blocker. Uh, 
And a Righteous Blow. That's a good card. So what do we want to do here? Make this 3-2. want to trade there. Yeah, let's just put on our Spirit. Well, he doesn't get anything. He gets plus one, plus one. No Vig, though. I would like to kill with the Righteous Blow. Alright, that's that. I think it'd be in our interest to bring in a little enchantment hate on the side. Oh, this is going to be big. But luckily, Terrifying Presence handles that. We can continue to beat for three in the air. Yeah, let's control the skies. Pathbreaker Worm is a big dude. That's pretty good too. And that with Trample is very good. Alright, no swings. That'll swine it up. Continue the Sky Assault. This card is amazing. Fog. Oh man. The Nettle Swine still kills the Pathbreaker Worm though. He can pump. 6 to 12. Yeah, let's just let our Seraph die. We don't have any enchant removal main deck. You already used our crippling his crippling chill this turn. As long as it doesn't have an answer for our, our sky, I think we can get there. Ooh, we get our own worm. Well that's still tapped down. That's a bummer. But no swine still kills the Pathbreaker Worm, but then we can't play our Pathbreaker Worm. Drop in my water. He's running low on cards. Hmm. We're going to be chumping this after a while. Is it better just to kill this or the Trample Soul Bonder? Hmm. Yeah, I think we can get by. We have, after this, was it three more turns of swinging? This is definitely putting all our eggs on the, the Moonlight Geist plan. Yeah, let's just play out our Pathbreaker Worm this turn. Bond it with the Nettle Swine. We can chump with our Valiant. Or just let him do a double pump. Was that? One, two, three, one, two. So we could take 12 here. Dropping us to 14. It has Trample. Yeah, let's just take it. We have Terrifying Presence. This will tap them out, practically. I 
and six is not a big deal. It's not too big a deal either. Still th three turns away after this, or two turns after this. If we swing with this, we only pretty much trade with a nettle swine. Swing with a nettle swine, we trade with a two for one. Yeah, let's get in there with the nettle swine. Go swine for swine, I'm okay with it. If he double blocks, then I can just kill the shield mate. Swing everything. Hmm. Now I'll just go with the skies. Hope it's good enough. Already used up our joint assault. He certainly. Got a bit of a flood on his hands. Oh wow, he's getting after it. Make him pump for all his worth. He's a brave guy. I'll give him that. I think I didn't have a counter or something for that. <laughs> Alright, that's good for us. Uh, what's good here? He had a lot of big dudes. Archangel's pretty good. Natural end destroys his his duder. Yeah, let's bring in one of these. And I think we can out aggro him. Flyers were important. Armaments might be worth bringing in over the bladed bracers a little slower but the evasion seems pretty good in this match so take that out and vigilance reach trample uh, let's cut the trample for the evasion I hope we land one of these lumber nuts in a game. Yeah, let's try that out. Hoping to crack a defang. All right, let's hit some lands. Too bad our blessings in our hand, but I'll take it. I really want to hit that land. Two lands, ideally, in two turns. Land. Uh oh. I don't want to get first struck out. He's curving out nicely. Hopefully we can do the same. Oh boy. Well, at least we can play it. Yeah, 
Yeah, let's take four. There's our land. But we're going to sit on it. We're going to keep our trick open and our first strike. Well, you can joint assault or just trade. I'm fine trading. I'll have us both use our first strike. Hopefully it takes his turn away. No follow up play would be great, but he's got one. That's not too big of an issue. Give us a bond. Alright. Mana! Not the best. Yeah, let's just play out the Geist. Uh, Lumber out would so good here. Hmm. Let's play the Geist unbonded. I really want to hit that Lumber Knot with a bond. Trade here in the interest of damage prevention. And for that reason, let's. Oh, we're unbonded. I don't want to go to 10. This is our only flyer, though. I'm going to go to 10. I've reconsidered. Good thinking. Mana right on cue. Let's bond up a lumber nut. And then we can bond our Geist next turn to kill the Seraph. With Joint Assault open. Bounce spell is pretty shitty for us. That's pretty shitty for us as well. We're going to need another soul bonder. We have the Geist. Yeah, let's kill something. That's that's okay. And here, I think I want to play Peddler. Bond it with our Geist. Keep the defensive going. Stay in the defensive. Defang would be shitty, and he's got it. But Joint Assault keeps him alive. And it keeps us at a healthy life total. We're probably in our interest to just... Uh, we can still chump block. Alright, now let's get the Geist Trappers on the field. Pairing with our lumber nut. And let's hit this bastard for five. Well, he's not blocking anything anytime soon.
Might be able to stage a comeback. Hmm. Is he just gaining life here? I don't want to get tricked out. So I'm going to let that guy die. And probably play Blessing of Nature on our Geist Trapper. Or do I want to get some death touchy guys going? Hmm. Yeah, let's get a death touch lumber knot going. And attack with the geist catchers here. Or trappers rather. And if he swings in on us, then we'll be able to see if he's got a trick or not. I think we're in a pretty good position where we don't need to rush it. And I don't want to get... I don't want to block the Seraph. Hmm. Alright. He's unhappy. So I can assume he doesn't have a trick. So let's get some force mages going. Bond those puppies together. Yeah, let's try to close this out. He's going to need a miracle pump spell to get past our trappers. He's going to need a couple of cards to get us. But he's definitely pissed at his flood. <laughs> What's he complaining about? This draft was paid for with a Tamiyo. Yeah, I, I can't feel bad for him when he gets a Tamiyo, so... I'm happy to be in the finals, and I'm happy that guy lost with a Tamiyo. So, everyone's a winner. I'll see you for the finals.